will call the work session back to order. Um, this is probably one of the toughest things I've ever done in my entire life. But I know it's right. Um, because I'm not a quitter. But I'm not the right leader for this council anymore. And I'm, I'm concerned where the city is going, because this is simple math. And we're not doing very well on the test. But I can tell that really I am not the right person. And I'm a busy guy. I've always believed in making sacrifices for public service. Um, and I love Clearwater. And I love some of the things we've gotten done. I think Imagine's going to be phenomenal. Uh, I think Ms. Poyer's going to do a great job as city manager. But in good conscience, for my family, for my own health and other things, I can't remain the mayor. Uh, I would highly recommend you appoint Hoyt uh, for the interim. At least he knows the city. You're going to have to appoint somebody who doesn't want to be uh, the next mayor. And I know this is shocking, but I just, I'm the wrong guy right now. And um, I just called my wife. She's shocked. Um, and I don't ever quit anything. But it's been more and more obvious to me that as much as I love the city and as much as I want to stick around for some of the things that are going to occur over the next couple months, I simply am not the right person to be here anymore. So thank you all and God bless you in this city. I wish you all the best. Thank you for all you've been to me. After countless ribbon cuttings and scores of meetings, Frank Hibbard resigns in his third term as Clearwater Mayor. Uh, the city is well run. There's no corruption in the city. I think there's a fundamental disagreement. A disagreement, says Hibbard, over City Council's priorities for spending, like a proposal to build a new $90 million City Hall. It was at the top of the list for most on City Council, but at the bottom of Hibbard's list and the subject of the last discussion before he packed his things and left. I think they're making decisions that are going to have negative ramifications.